Peace family, I am Z the Empress and I'm back with another reading for you guys and this is Tarot After Dark. Okay, so um, please make sure you like, share, and subscribe to my channel if this reading resonates with you. Drop a comment. I love comments. I really appreciate when you guys leave comments. I love them. Okay, um, getting feedback from y'all is is always important to me okay all right so oh and welcome new subscribers thank you for subscribing okay so I already pulled your cards guys and um, I'm just gonna get into the reading right now okay so the first card I got which is the ace of Pentacles can you guys see that ace of Pentacles so this is a very positive card, positive omen, the Ace of Pentacles. Um, this represents financial gains, prosperity, abundance. Um, could also represent a form of inheritance, a lump sum of cash. Okay, some of you guys may be winning a lawsuit. So congratulations. And feel free to, you know, share the wealth. You can cash out me, Z the Emperor's, okay? <laughs> share the wealth. <laughs> okay, or someone could be hitting the lottery or receiving an inheritance. So, congratulations to you, okay, in your new abundance. Or if you don't have this now, you will. This is coming your way. The first card is always the strongest. And prosperity is here. Prosperity is yours now. You are prosperous. Okay? You are. You better believe it. So the next card I got was the tower in reverse. Okay? So you guys may have avoided a tower moment. A moment. Okay? You guys may have made the right decision. Or tighten up, you know, before it was too late. Or you guys might have been slipping, but you got it together. So that's all that matters, is that you got it together. You caught yourself, you recognized the problem, you corrected it, and now you're the empress. Now, now you're able to come into this empress energy. Many of you guys, some of you guys are the empress. Some of you guys are glowing up. Some of you guys are flourishing. I'm, I'm, hearing, I'm hearing, I'm loving the woman that I'm becoming. Or the man that I'm becoming. Some of you guys are growing up, maturing. I'm hearing back then they didn't want me. Now I'm hot, they all on me. Okay? Um, yeah, you're feeling yourself, you're confident, you know, you're desired, but also some of you guys are nurturing, some of you guys, somebody's going to drop a project and it's going to be very successful. Some of you guys may be getting discouraged with the next card being the Nine of Wands. Some of you guys may be getting discouraged or on your last limb. Some of you guys are winging it. You're about to give up. But you're this close. Like, it's here. It's like literally on the other side of the door. Don't give up. Don't give up because you got the first card was the Ace of Pentacles. Success is yours. Affirm it. Claim it. Because it's yours. You are abundant now. If you don't have this now, it's coming. Or you have the opportunity to come into a lot of money. A lot of money.
some of you guys are going to make it out of poverty. You know. Now, at the bottom of the deck, we have the Queen of Cups. Okay, the Queen of Cups. Very giving, very caring, nurturing, and, you know, the Queen of Cups is your best friend. A genuine friendship. But the Queen of Cups can also come off as aloof, detached, or dismissive. Some of you guys may be in the arts. Some of you guys may be starting a, a YouTube channel or thinking about starting a YouTube channel. Um, excuse me, I my, my ankle is itching. <laughs> Sorry. I had a scratchy. Sorry. Okay. So, some of you guys, you know what? I feel like some of you guys may not have as much a support as you you feel you need and I'm here to tell you that all you need is yourself all you need is to believe in you you don't need to convince everyone else of what you already know it's true just be that whatever that is be that and live in that truth because when you're a pure you're in your purest form you are able to manifest and gain and attract so much more of that to you you ever hear your vibe attracts your tribe that is true you are going to begin to attract your tribe, your soul tribe. Okay? No more will you get the short end of the stick. There's a shift happening. So, I'm oh, sorry, y'all. Trying to get these my other cards there's a shift happening so let's see what the energy is looking like okay the shift let's see the energy is okay for the entire collective the energy of the entire collective what do they need to know just an important message is for the entire collective part leave it in my hands <laughs> overall energy of the entire okay so I'm telling me this card okay our angel Met Metatron very powerful card I don't know if you're able to see that. It's so bright. Okay, our angel. Metatron. Okay. And he, he represents the sixth chakra. Okay. Which is the crown. Clarity of thought, personal vision. That's what this card represents. Okay, it says this very powerful Archangel Metatron brings brilliant indigo vibrations 
to your brow chakra or oh it's actually your third eye sorry which is the center devoted to insight and clear thought when this card appears upright and indicates as much clarity in your thought process and an expanded perspective towards brighter horizons some new perspectives are some new perceptions are taking hold and the clouds of confusion are clearing in some ways this could be a new beginning of of a um, new beginning for your on your way to developing a deeper insight about what's going on in your life and why now is the time to focus on your personal vision what do you want your life to look like in the years ahead create a clear picture of that and support it with your daily thoughts the insights you need to create a vibrant life is available to you now Archangel Metatron okay it says my sixth chakra is open to perfect healthy state to its perfect, he perfect healthy state my personal vision guides me and my thoughts are peaceful and clear Ashe okay um let's see let me pick one no okay i don't have to pick another card i'm just gonna look at the bottom and it's a woman holding holding a heart so hmm. was a relationship having you guys feeling defeated are you guys feeling defeated because of a relationship don't it wasn't meant to be. Something is better for you. This is 40 and the 44. A lot of fours in here. Okay. Powerful number. Okay. Maybe you're going to get what you want. Love and happiness. Finally. Okay. Finally. Okay. So. The woman on this card wears a butterfly. Oh, is this in her hair? Okay, um, and holds a lovely large heart in her hands. For a woman, this card upright could be a reflection of your own state of peaceful emotion and receptivity for love, or it might be a message that your family issues are going to resolve. You're an intuitive woman who understands the emotions of life and you're bringing that awareness to all that you do. This card upright could also indicate the presence of a female friend, teacher, or confidant who's here to help with issues of love, family, or emotion. This is an even-tempered, caring person who resonates with you and your emotions. This could also potent a new love, interest, or friend coming your way and it is because the next card is a man holding a heart after it i can't make this up it's a woman holding a heart and a man holding a heart yo like yo you're getting i you're about to get everything you've ever desired Everything you've been praying and dreaming and hoping for is on the way. Or it's here now. Because everything is existing simultaneously at the same time. Okay? Yo. I believe. Like, I believe this is true, yo. So, congratulations on that new love. Okay? A new relationship. Marriage. The Empress also represents motherhood. So, some of you guys may be expecting a new child. Okay? Some of you guys may be getting engaged or married soon. Okay? And having a baby. Okay? And starting a family. Oh, my gosh. Blessings. Blessings. Congratulations. Many blessings to you guys. On that, okay, I do have to pull one more card for you guys. Case from my Whispers of Nature deck, which I love. Okay. So, sort of creation.
what does the collective need to know at this time to wrap it up? Okay. Oh, okay. Right. Illumination. Like I said, some of you guys are glowing up. You're glowing. You're 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 going to the next level, okay? Your dreams are, are about to come true, guys. I, I, I feel intuition. Look, I said I feel. Follow your intuition. Third eye. You got the Archangel Metatron, which is third eye. Intuition. Intuition. Beautiful card, isn't it? Okay, let's see what's at the bottom. Be in service. Okay, you need to be in service. You need to give back or you need to be doing what you're supposed to be doing, which is your purpose. Okay. But let me see what intuition says. I just want to know. <laughs> okay. Because I don't think I've ever pulled that card before. So, it's a beautiful card. This is intuition. First time pulling this beautiful card. You just seem to have a knack for knowing what's going to work. Your creative process is unique to you. You just you just get you just get started and magic happens. You have a lot of endurance and you're a hard worker. Once you get focused on a project, you don't stop. You are a trendsetter and you seem to understand what people love. You are very forward thinking. You are being reminded that you have your own inner voice guiding you always. Tap into your wisdom and allow yourself the high, this higher perspective. It's like your brain's getting illuminated it's with illumination. Okay. All right, y'all. And we just had a full moon, y'all. So it says, just as the full moon sheds its light in our world, you are being shown that this, that there is hope and guidance for you. Have faith. Just holding on to belief in yourself will plant the seed of manifestation in your life. You are being asked to release any worry or fear that you may be harboring. This clarity you desire is at hand. I keep We keep getting clarity, okay? All you need to do all you need is something in which to place your faith. So trust in yourself, your support, and the divine. You will be assisted in difficult times. This can also signify inspiration and new love. This is a shedding of light on hidden treasures or surprises. Beautiful blessings. Okay, so that is your reading, guys. I really hope you guys enjoy this reading. And if it resonated with you, feel free to leave a comment. I love comments. Um, I love interacting with you guys, okay? Um, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell button so you'll never miss a reading. Follow me on Twitter, um, Z the Empress 2. Follow me on Instagram, Z the Empress 2, okay? Um, and thank you guys so much. Peace, love, and abundance, y'all. Until next time. Bye.